uh, start calving on the 9th of July in Hooks Bay. We're not a real warm area, we're about 300 metres up here and uh, spring can kick in a little bit later but at the moment we've found yeah, since we're foliar feeding um, yeah, we calve the 9th of July and we had 450 of the 550 cows have calved in four weeks so it's been pretty intense and I know as soon as they calve the crucial thing is is lime calcium they need calcium and at least 65 grams getting straight into them so spraying it on we can spray up to five days as long as we don't get a lot of rain which we're not getting a lot at the moment uh, we can spray you know work on five days ahead of ourselves yeah 200 grams for the the colostrum lot of uh, lime and a hundred of, of mag oxide. It's running what we're running on milk is 50 grams of mag oxide and we're running 150 of lime flour and we're having a good run with that. Cows are just on grass and we're actually feeding raffno, five kilos of raffno which is uh, radish and we're sort of at the moment around two kilos a cow which is pretty good pretty happy at the moment with, with how they're going. You know every cow that's that's going to eat this is going to get some calcium or lime and magnesium and hopefully it just saves your time in the cow shed. Uh, one of the benefit uh, with spraying it on is, is you're using a lot less product because you know it's sticking to the plant and it's not blowing all the way down the countryside so there's a big saving there over a period of a year. Uh, we're putting a hundred Cause, cause mag to get 50 into the cow um, when you're dusting but if you're doing it this way you are only putting on 50 grams and with the, um, the lime we're putting on we're wanting to get 150 grams into the cow so we're, we're, we're just using 150 grams whereas if we're dusting we're at yeah, 200 200 plus uh, the benefit of using a spray for mixing it with a time third is that you can Spray it on and knowing that the neighbour's not going to get all your cause mag and lime because most of it blows down. Um, it saves a lot if you're drenching in the, in the cow shed. You know, you can instead of having to drench, you can spray it on a break and know that even cow's going to get some.